Okay. We are going to do a tongue tie clip. These simple ones are easy, even for a, a guy like me. That's just a curved scissors. And this is a little tongue depressor. The, the, the little membrane I'm going to clip will go right through there. You lift up and snip. You'll see me do that. It takes a split second. So, yeah, let's go do it. It's no big deal. I'm gonna let her hold the light for me if that's okay. In the hands. So you'll see there's a membrane under the tongue. Move the there you go. I got it, but I'm gonna double check. There's a drop of blood in there, but it's 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 loosened up. We, we loosened up a couple millimeters. Oh, look at Mama Comfort. There you me. go. There you go. So this is a three-day-old, you guys, who's actually latching reasonably well. And we've got an experienced mom, so it was somewhat optional. But that tongue was attached right basically to the end. And there's going to be some improvement in the latch. So better function to breastfeeding. I wasn't really worried about language per se, but... We don't have to worry about it at all now. So if you, as you saw, it's a very simple procedure. I don't just do them routinely. I generally only do them when we're having feeding problems. But um, with the, <laughs> we're in the COVID-19 era, folks. And I was, I'm telling my new moms, I may not see you again for a few months, depending on what happens around here. We may do virtual visits. And so I just wanted to help get this taken care of while you were here. So most tongue tie procedures are done to help with feeding. So if you are having a painful latch, or an ineffective latch and you're not being successful with breastfeeding this is something to consider now the type of tongue tie revision that i did that simple snip most pediatricians can do that for you the more extensive one where you're lasering the entire uh, bottom of the tongue there when it's attached down uh, what they call a posterior tongue tie requires laser i don't have that equipment you have to find somebody that not only has the equipment but is skilled at doing that we have a couple people Oh, a handful of people in Portland, Oregon, which is a greater Portland metropolitan area is 2 million people with only a handful of people that can do it. There's a lot of demand. Um, so that's the story on tongue tie. Thanks for watching. A huge thumbs up for we got a special mom baby combo here. Thanks for watching. I'm Dr. Paul. Feels weird having a mask on. Do <sighs> claustrophobic? Yeah, I don't like I don't like masks.